The Philippine Air Force has announced its intention to increase the country's military strength with plans to acquire 12 to 18 T-129 attack helicopters. The first batch of two of the six Turkish-made T-129 ATAK attack helicopters ordered for the Philippine Air Force PAF, has been delivered at Clark Air Base, in Mabalacat City, Pampanga. The two helicopters along with its initial logistics support arrived on board two A400M tactical transporters of the Turkish Air Force, the PAF said. A total of six units of the T-129 were acquired as part of the Armed Forces of the Philippines Modernization Plan. Horizon 2 under Republic Act 9184 or the Government Procurement Reform Act. The deal includes logistics support and training of PAF pilots and crew in Turkey. A PAF spokesman said the two T-129 helicopters and its initial logistics support arrived March 9 around 12.30 a.m. at Clark Air Base. He said there was no definite dates for the arrival of the other four helicopters. The ATAK helicopters will complement the existing two units of strike-capable helicopters in the PAF's fleet include Augusta Westland AW-109 and McDonnell Douglas MG-520 in support of the numerous missions carried out by the armed forces. It was reported that the PAF 15th Strike Wing will operate the T-129 helicopters which will be used for close air support for ground troops and armed surveillance and reconnaissance. The T-129 is a twin-engine, tandem-seat, multi-role, all-weather attack helicopter designed for attack and reconnaissance missions in hot and high environments and rough geography in both day and night conditions. Aerospace company Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, was reported to have delivered the last batch of two T-129 BATAK attack helicopters to the Philippine Air Force, PAF. The helicopters arrived at Clark Air Base in the Philippines via Turkish Air Force A400M Atlas Transport Aircraft on 30 November 2023. Philippine defense page Max Defense Philippines said that the helicopters are already undergoing flight tests and inspections in preparation for their induction into service with the PAF's 18th Attack Squadron, 15th Strike Wing. The Philippines Department of National Defense, DND, ordered six new T-129 BATAK attack helicopters under a 13.728 billion Philippine pesos, 284.8 million United States dollars, government to government, G2G, deal between the Philippines and Turkey. The Philippines is the first export market of the T-129 ATAK attack helicopter which is a Turkish derivative and modernized version of the Italian-made Augusta A129 Mangusta, built by Turkish Aerospace Industries and heavily uses Turkish technology. The T-129 BATAK is the Philippines' first dedicated attack helicopter, as the PAF usually operate armed versions of light helicopters which includes the MD Helicopters MD-520 MG Defender and Augusta Westland AW-109E Power currently in its fleet. Four other helicopters were delivered in two batches on March 2022 and November 2022, and have already seen action against local communist insurgents with devastating effects. The T-129 BATAK is armed with a NM-197 20mm rotary cannon, and four hardpoints allowing for rocket pods for guided and unguided rockets, the Rocketson UMTAS anti-tank air-to-ground missile, and the air-to-air -air stinger, ATAS, short-range air-to-air missile. The Philippines, which recently received the first T-129 ATAK attack and tactical reconnaissance helicopters, has ordered additional helicopters. Having signed an agreement with Turkish Aerospace Industries, TUSAS, for the supply of 60 129 ATAK attack and tactical reconnaissance helicopters in 2018, the Philippines received the first two helicopters in March 2022. With the new delivery in November 2022, additional orders came from the Philippines, which received two more ATAKs. According to the information obtained by Sabuma Senestcom, 
the Philippine Air Force has placed an additional T-129 ATAK order by using its options within the scope of its 6 T-129 ATAK helicopter order in 2018. Although it is not known how many ATAKs the additional order covers, the 6 T-129 ATAK supply contract signed between the Philippines and Thai in 2018 had many options. The Philippines' second batch of ATAK order is estimated to include six helicopters. Turkish Aerospace Industries, which will deliver a total of 60 129 ATAKs to the Philippine Air Force under the contract worth approximately 280 million United States dollars, will deliver the remaining two helicopters in 2024. Thai which will continue its T-129 ATAK deliveries to Nigeria with Turkish security units in 2022, will focus on the Philippines in 2024.